Hi everyone, it's Andrea Shepard with InsuranceWebDesigns.com and I am creating this short video for you um, because I've gotten a lot of questions about um, when you've got a personal Facebook page. Here is my personal Facebook page. This is my Facebook account. Okay, but I also have a page for our business, InsuranceWebDesigns.com. So um, when you click on the Facebook logo, you're going to come to what's known as your Facebook wall. This is your wall, your news feed, either or. There, well, actually, I guess this is your wall. And this, when you click on the icon, is your news feed. Okay, so <clears throat> when you want to post as yourself, you can do it from your news feed. You can do it from over here. You can click here. Um, to get to your your own wall and you can post there most people do it from here or their phone actually um, so along the left hand side or some you can have your your favorites you know kind of stacked on top of each other near the top then there's pages and pages that you manage so if you um, manage more than one then you can go to more and um, select the page you want to post to, which is what I am going to do. So, if I want to make a post for Insurance Web Designs, I'm going to click on the page for Insurance Web Designs. Okay, so when I go to write something here to post, you'll notice that here it says posting as Insurance Web Designs Inc. or I can select to post as myself but then I won't have access to, you only have access to the, the editing of the page when you're, when you're logged in like this. So I can, this is a demo for Facebook video, okay? And you hit publish and boom. So there you go. So if I want to like this post, not as insurance web designs, cause that's just silly. But if I want to be myself, see, now I can like and comment as my personal, my, me, not uh, me representing a company, but as me. Um, so that's how you do it. That's it. There's, there's nothing more complicated. So business accounts um, like this, business pages are tied to personal pages. A person has to be an admin of a business account. So you can't just have a business page with Facebook, you've got to have a personal, um, you don't have to use the personal account. You could have it solely so that you can manage a business page, but you do have to have a personal account. So um, anyone who comes to your Facebook business page cannot tell how many admins are there are for the page. So like there's multiple admins for insurance web designs but you wouldn't know that because it doesn't share that information which is good right so it doesn't matter what your personal account is um, no one knows um, unless you post as yourself and not as the business that's the only way someone would see your personal account so i hope that made sense if you have more questions please comment below and i will answer them thanks